YouTube Sam is here and in this video guys I will show you how to jailbreak iOS 10 to 10.2 Yalu jailbreak supports all devices except iPhone 7 so yeah guys the final version of the jailbreak is here it's semi untethered jailbreak means if you restart the device you have to jailbreak again using the Yalu app but you don't need a computer once you jailbreak so yeah guys without any further ado let's just jump in alright guys first of all go to your browser and go to cityimpact.com the link is mentioned in the description just go to this website and this program is available for Mac OS X Windows Linux download it as your preference the second link which is Yalu jailbreak beta 7 so you just have to download this IPA of the jailbreak this supports all devices except iPhone 7 click on IPA CDI impact and you will get the IPA now I already got both of the files here Yalu jailbreak and CDI impact open up CDI impact don't launch it as an administrator and you don't need iTunes when really installed on your computer not running guys just installed so connect your device at this point and drag the IPA in CDI Impactor and enter your Apple ID. Once you enter your Apple ID, it will take a little bit of time to sign the application for you on your home screen. So just be patient and wait until it pops up on your home screen. Once it's done, you will get the message of complete. That's it from the computer side. Let's get back to the device. Once it's done, go to settings. Then you want to go to general, then scroll down, go to profiles or device management or device button. Just tap on that, tap on your Apple ID and tap on trust, trust again and the jailbreak file will gonna get verified. So you can launch it now and as you guys can see I'm trying this on my 6 plus. So launch it. Once you launch it, you need to make sure you do some necessary steps which are you need to turn off the passcode. So let me just turn off the passcode. Once you turn off the passcode, you are ready to do for the jailbreak. Just launch the application. Then you want to press go and you have to wait at this point. Let the device do its stuff so you don't have to mess around with anything. Just let it do its stuff. Once you're back, if you don't get the jailbreak file, you need to do the process again. So I will not edit the video. So it is what it is. So just tap on go again and wait. If you get this message, just tap on done. Once the device turns on, open it up and you will get Cydia guys. So as you guys saw, it didn't work for the first time and now it's working perfectly fine. So open it up and there we go guys, it's working perfectly fine. So yeah guys, that's basically it for today's video guys. If you like this video, please be sure to smash that like button and if you have any problems or this works for you, make sure to comment down in the comment section guys and share this video to your friends and family and subscribe to my channel for tons of new videos. As always guys, Sam is here signing off.